Hey guys, James here again. This is going to be what if Naruto was born with all gates mastered. Basically, what I mean by this is Naruto's body would already be in its peak shape to use all gates at birth. So his body, his body is going to be very similar. Not body, but it would be his body, but his muscle structure would be very similar to Meat City from from Tokyo Revengers. It'd be very similar for, to Meat City from Demon Slayer. He has eight fold muscles, which means her muscles muscles are eight times stronger than they should be. Like, but they're folded over so they can fit her body. Naruto's body would be very similar to that. But instead of his muscles being folded eight, being folded over eight times, it's a lot more than eight. Probably, probably roughly around like 30 times over. So, so he's 30 times stronger than a regular kid his age. Actually, let me do math real quick. So if you do proper math, an average adult may be like three, four times stronger than an average kid, probably even up to ten times. But these are ninja that are highly trained, so I'd actually be go on a better spectrum at roughly around 14 times stronger. Not just a baby is 30 times stronger than most people. Most average adults, he's 30 times stronger than that, and ninja are above that. So Naruto just naturally born with just peak strength and speed. <clears throat> Plus, with his muscles being so, being so condensed and folded over that he's just basically almost impenetrable. This is just how strong he is. So, yeah. So, with this, we can go on to probably just Naruto when he's roughly around 7 years old. You know, seven year old Uchiha Massacre had already happened, and Naruto is actually, actually pretty well known as a recent recent user of Taijutsu. Naruto actually did want to know why like people were scared to fight him. Even like some ninja don't want to go near Naruto when it comes to, like chasing him because one, he's about as fast as sound is. Just at seven year old, he's faster than he's about as fast as sound is, just because he's he's running. Then if you were to if you charge him to speed, he's moving as fast as lightning is. And keep in mind, he is still seven. So yeah. Even, like, some ninja, like, throwing Kunai at Naruto, and they've stuck into his skin, but he's pulled it out with no blood on it whatsoever. And it didn't leave a scar or anything. Like, that's just how, that's just how condensed and strong he is. Like, you have a kunai into him and pull it out the wrong way, you will lose your, you will lose the end of your kunai. <laughs> but, yeah. But, eventually, Naruto sure happened to be wandering around as he bought a book on human biology to figure out why he's different, and just realized his muscles are probably folded over a dozen times, because that's how, that's how it feels. Like hell, like he's been like, he's in the nurse's office in like the like this academy to, well, not not for himself, but honestly because he's checking on Sasuke because he knocked he broke his nose at one point. But the nurse basically told Naruto his muscles are very dense and thick. But then he started analyzing how muscles should be, and then realizes his muscles are very condensed. And then well, yeah, it's a nurse and says so it's like well, it's likely that they seem folded over with how they feel. So, and muscles are just dozen times stronger than they should be. So yeah. But, uh, yeah. But, uh, we can go on to Naruto probably just, well, wanting to find out how to use his strength in a proper way. Is, is this Taijutsu kind of lacking? But he has such superior strength and speed that doesn't matter. So, yeah. But with this, well, the librarian does give Naruto basically just books, not books, but scrolls on Taijutsu. Let Naruto know that he'd have to pay a lot for these because they already go for a lot because they're, they're first shinobi. Well, not because not they're for shinobi, they're for anyone, really. But they're basically shinobi skills. And they also pay so much because one of them even teaches you, teaches you how to use chakra control. So Naruto doesn't know how to make money, but he actually does get a job offer, offer from Teiichi and Teiichi heard about this. So Naruto works at Ichiraku to earn money for this. Years later, Naruto's nine years old and has enough money to buy all, to buy the scrolls. He buys them and will learn, learn, learn to ha to ha how to control chakra and also learn, learn martial arts. Naruto's martial arts skills actually, actually mainly consist of things like Tai Chi, Wing Chun, and Jeet Kune Do. But the more, like, I guess, I guess the martial art that'd be a bit more, like, for him that he prefers to use would honestly actually, actually just be Muay Thai. So, yeah. So, so, Muay Thai, Wing Chun, Tai Chi, and Jeet Kune Do. Those are the four martial arts that Naruto mainly uses. But these actually, actually, actually would make his footwork very hard to beat. Because, like, even with him, even when he's just calm, he moves insanely fast, fluid, and smooth. So it's very, very hard, hard to get one up on him. But yeah. Uh, we want to go into Narcissus 12, with Narcissus 12 now. We said we already, we already been taught how to control chakra from the scrolls. Well, actually, he actually already knew how to, how to use most nature releases by himself. So it wasn't too hard to do that. So, yeah. Most nature. You can use a few of them, like uh, wind and fire mainly. He can do great breakthrough. Breakthrough. He can do fireball jutsu. Um, he can do wind scythe jutsu. 
stuff like that. And Gale Palm. Because you can also enhance the strength and speed with with that stuff as well. So, yeah, so uh it's on the twelve and not sure how you had graduated. Actually, as rookie of the year in most subjects besides basic intelligence. We're gonna basic intelligence. Sage actually tutored Naruto alongside IMA. And those two got Naruto to roughly around well, using the regular classroom. Red classroom should have roughly twenty students, plus well actually nowadays is for me it's around twenty six students. But then a lot of them are also absent, with leading to like 13, 14 students in total in a regular, regular class. We're going to use that. In placements are those regular 15, 14 to 16 students. Not enough to place roughly around, around 8 out of them all in, the, in terms of basic intelligence. But not just overall stats that landed him Rookie of the Year because his, his, his Taijutsu, A rank. His Ninjutsu, S rank. He, he can use two natures pretty well, actually. You know, plus, he can already, you know, already walk on trees and water. Then just his, his physical strength. RDS, RDS, his speed, S, S plus. Then, well, his strength is actually triple S plus. Not, not just basic speed, double S plus. And then, well, his battle IQ is actually really high, because all he does is really train and work out. Plus, actually, his sparring training partners consist of Shikamaru and Choji, and Shikamaru does no battle strategies for Naruto. It may not be on purpose, but he can tell Naruto how to, how to work out, I don't know how to work out, but how to actually use his abilities properly. I don't think that's the right wording either. Oh, so Shikamaru and Choji are basically just, um, well, Shikamaru is actually able to give Naruto pointers when it comes to battle, saying, hey, Naruto, you know, you know, you know, if you control your strength in a certain way, you can cause a bit more damage. I was pointing out, like, some weak points on, like, on, like Naruto's human, bi human biology book, because Naruto's dumb as all hell, and Shikamaru is, is unintentionally very intelligent. So, yeah. So, in exchange, actually does is teach those two, like, just basic tactics he uses in fights. And these, these tactics essentially end fights in seconds, no matter how strong you are. This is basically one of them. It's actually very good because Shikamaru and Toji happen to have decent reaction speed. Just kick out one leg, kick out the other, then elbow right in the jaw. Should that should knock him out in a second or daze them. One of the two. But hey, it's, it's enough for, for an escape or, or or for easy victory. Well, if it's someone like someone is it gets me someone if it's against someone like me or Toji who are pretty durable, then yeah, it's not not gonna work with whatsoever. So yeah. We also, also did say for going to block a punch, use your elbows and slam it into their fingers. And if they're not using using proper 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 prop protection, you'll break most of their fingers. He ended up getting put his thumbs up. Actually, Ron Choji actually asked how he did it, how he, how he knows this, but he's a, he's not gonna tell them how many Shinobi have had their fingers broken on, on his elbows. But yeah. So with this we can go on to probably just um we can go on to I'm gonna say probably just music -y. No, not to have him be out late, working out. We should come on Choji just walking up to him, bringing him food. So they've finished their workout already. Yeah, and they're, they're dropping off snacks for Naruto. He take, take the snacks, thanking them. And well, Naruto had discovered the gates already. He discovered them a few years ago, actually. Even before he began, learned, began, began learning about human biology and Taijutsu. Naruto, in terms of gates, the ones that he used the most often are actually the first and second gate. The first and second gate are the gate of opening and the gate of healing. The gate of opening removes any, any mental, mental restraint or strain. The second gate, get a healing, which actually increases your strength and your energy. I don't think it increases your chakra effect that's mainly used by non-chakra users. But also, it's used by Guy, and Guy only uses summoning jutsu, really. So, it may increase, increase your chakra, but we don't know, because no one, no one that uses chakra, or no one that uses chakra normally uses it. Yeah, Lee uses it to water walk and tree walk, same as it might Guy and might die. But, I don't think that they ever use any, any, any normal, normal jutsu besides tree walking, water walking, and summoning. So we, we we may never know if it increases your chakra, but as far as we know, it doesn't. So it just increases your basic your basic stamina and and, and all that, like stamina and endurance, increases all that. So yeah. So no, 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 no can use those can use those two gates for like two weeks on end. But some of those, 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 those weeks are up, he'll just be completely completely tired for like a whole day before he can reuse it again. So he so he gives like the, the gates one day of rest, and then that's pretty good for him. Well, yeah, we can use all gates if he wants to, and the eighth gate wouldn't kill him, but it would actually, it would actually, actually kind of permanently injure him. Like you know how, how my guy lost half of his foot, not his whole leg, half of his foot. Probably, I'm pretty sure actually wouldn't even have his foot. I'm pretty sure it was like only, like I'm pretty sure it was just all of his toes. <laughs> but yeah. So yeah, but um, yeah, no, 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 sure use all the gates pretty efficiently. And with his muscles, they don't really tear them apart. It's going to be t incredibly hard to even tear, tear one muscle to work out. Yeah, working out for Naruto doesn't really help him grow in strength. 
You be compared? His body is always, always at its max limit in terms of strength, speed, and everything. His body can't grow any stronger than it is. All he can do is just spend his knowledge of fighting styles. So yeah. But the best way to say is Saitama. His body already, already Saitama's body already, already broke, already broke, bro, broke its limiters, and Saitama thinks that he can't get any stronger than he is now. Not his body broke his natural limits, then grew, grew to its peak, grew, grew to its peak beyond limiters. It cannot get any stronger than that. So yeah. Yeah, yeah no, no, King is stronger with age, and that's it. He can get stronger and get stronger through working out. Like you'll say, let's say he's twelve right now. When he's thirteen, boom, he gets stronger. That's it. So that's how that's how his body works. If if he were to grow in height and need need, need, need need a bit more muscle, that's how that's how he gets stronger. If he gains weight, needs more muscle, boom, that's how it works. So yeah. But the Mizuki thing now. So Mizuki ha happened happened to be running by, so he bumped into Naruto. He thought, he, thought he, 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 he ran into a tree, so he looked at what he ran into seeing just thing just a 13 year old Naruto, just bulky as all hell because it's Naruto with really, with really good muscles. You see that Misu tries to get out of the way and try to push him, but when he tried to push Naruto, Naruto wouldn't move a single inch. He thought he thought, he, thought he was like trying, trying, trying to push, push a boulder. Then Naruto just pushed Misuki back with like one hand and Misuki got sent flying. He was sent for Naruto telling Misuki that Misuki shouldn't have that scroll. Shimon pointed out that, that, that it's a scroll ceiling and a sacred scroll for the Okage. Then the Naruto had an idea. He appeared behind Misuki as he, as he just pushed Misuki, Misuki really hard. Then Misuki realized that the, the straps of his jacket were torn off. Or so the Naruto just snatched the scroll off his back. No, not just he'll drop it off with of Hiruzen. Those two can take care of Misuki. They're more, they're more than capable enough of dropping and tuning. They nod as they stand for as they stand for Misuki. Traditionally, well, so many Mizuki thinks that these are kind of useless because Shikamaru and Choji don't really do anything in class besides just well the basic le the basic leg 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 ah, basic leg sweep tactic. One thing, Naruto not Naruto knows knows multiple martial art not martial art is what he does but he knows he knows, he knows a, lot, a lot of martial arts. Shikamaru and Choji do take notes from these many martial arts. Main one that Shikamaru would actually main two that Shikamaru actually uses would actually be Tai Chi and Chinese Kempo. Then Choji would actually end up using, well, shockingly, jujitsu and sumo wrestling. So yeah, so so Misuki even tried to like just, just attack Choji. So he just gets like a good palm up like right to the chest, and then just gets a dozen of them right to the face. Before he suddenly just put in more of an Americana hold, as well as I'm pretty sure the Americana hold would actually crush your, crush your elbow or your or your, or your, or your elbow or your shoulder. I forgot. But I'm pretty sure it's your shoulder. So Choji so, so would execute the Americana hold successfully, making Misuki yell in pain. Only, only to just have to have his shit kicked in. Now, a lot of the, a lot of the Chinese tempo, I did, I did like done a few techniques, but I mainly, mainly use the ones from from like from Kenichi, the mightiest uh, disciple, because I like I like Kenichi. So, yeah, Shimura basically just used an armor crushing kick, which is basically just kick so hard that it would slice headgear, and he would use that to use that successfully on Misuki. As Misuki's headband's cut in half, even the steel part, and Misuki just falls down with his face cut wide open. So we're chuckling. Saying that if he used that move on anyone in the academy, he'd kill them. That's why, that's why he doesn't show off. Koji actually did a nice pick the Misuki with one hand, dragging him to the forest. So he sees see Naruto on a tree reading the scroll of ceiling. This is what Naruto's doing. He says, no, no, nothing, nothing. He's reading. Pause. So yeah. So, Shikamaru uh, uh, asks why Naruto's reading it. Naruto says, come on, Shikamaru and Toji, come, come read this real quick. This is confusing Shikamaru and Toji, Toji, but well, they're not, they're not going to they're not, they're not confuse orders from the one who's basically their leader. Plus, he's, he's, he's basically their, their sensei as well, the sensei and their leader. He says, there's there's jutsu from all the clans in here. Or, well, not all of them, but a lot of them have jutsu in here. He points out how Shikamaru's clan jutsu is right here, Choji's clan jutsu is down here. He doesn't have any clan jutsu for Uzumaki, but there's a few seals and other jutsu. So Naruto just through nature actually developed many abilities that he, that to make up for his lack of being able to grow in physical strength or speed. Which did include, how she gaining muscle memory and photographic memory. So he memorized everything, every single thing in here that he saw, which means he memorized the whole scroll of healing and techniques and the ways to actually learn how to use them. Naruto's gonna be broken as all hell. Shimaru even even reading this well, it's Naruto even just actually grabbed like got like well, kind of like broke off a large piece of bark, like two of them. But pencil is he actually taking notes in the forest because he did skip class today. He wrote down then everything really fast before he came to head and Shikamaru telling Shikamaru to just transfer it to paper or something. So Renato did the same thing for Choji, and then Choji took it and went home. Then Naruto gave the scroll back to Hiruzen, while well, some random ninja saying, saying Mizuki's in the forest and conscious somewhere. Well, Hiruzen already knew Shikamaru and, Shikamaru and Choji were those that beat up Mizuki. Naruto just said he'll return the scroll, but he didn't see them read it. 
We had a fast forward to the to them eating the sensei's. As 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 Asuma, as Asuma would, would walk in to just say like, just like say he's selecting Shikamaru, Toji, and Ino. When Shikamaru and Toji leave, they bow to Naruto, saying, saying it's been, it's been fun having him teach them. That's just confusing on what Shikamaru means, saying, oh, well, Naruto's been teaching us, been teaching us Taijutsu. Toji says, yeah, he's a really good teacher too. You know, Naruto. Speaking of that, after the the training exam is over, you should you you you, you, should, you should become a teacher. You know, this one Naruto just sighs, saying, I'll think about it. I don't really like kids. And Shikamaru says, just think about it, Naruto. But with that, well, this actually kind of shocks everyone. Everyone, 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 everyone training those two who don't try at all. Hell, he even trained train Kiba, Kiba with a few basic, basic, basic attack, tactics, tactics of MMA because Kiba seemed weak. Yeah, not a natural thing is help the weak, but Kiba didn't really accept the fact that he was weak and refused to actually help. Not help, but not refused to help, but not but refused to train with, with what Naruto taught him. So yeah. But Kiyashi would actually want to interview his team. He has the yes, likes and dislikes. Naruto actually doesn't like. Well, she no, not like this. He doesn't really hate anything at all. He doesn't dislike anything whatsoever. Well, Mizuki is one thing. That's really it. But Mizuki, Mizuki's dead. Honestly, Shikamaru will just kind of cut his face wide open and blood splatter through everywhere, and he bled out for like ten minutes straight. So, and Mizuki's dead. But yeah, Shikamaru also also knows that he's dead, but doesn't really care too much. So we each have like just Naruto. Um, well, this is his likes just really consists of training and his friends. You know, really, all those in Konoha, he's helped them all, and they're all really nice to him now. Yeah, Naruto doesn't do much besides actually really train and help out villagers. And at this point, they all like him. Plus, he has a job at Ichiraku, where he does where he does meet a lot of people. So yeah. So yeah, he still has a job at Ichiraku, despite him only only needing it for roughly two years. But with his job, well, he also he also made ramen the ninja way. He just uses uses his ninja skills to actually make makes you make to make ramen and make other dishes. So yeah, so Naruto's appetite went beyond ramen. He actually also also was one that made the Thunder Burger of the seen Bro or so. Yeah, so this one Naruto invented the burger. Nice, but, but he used it as as more as more like a protein filled snack. But yeah, Naruto brought a lot, a lot of new foods to Ichiraku, and now it's not called Ichiraku ramen, just called Ichiraku. Wait, push distance? Does that mean ramen or something? Supposedly, Ichiraku just means like comfort, music, and all that stuff. But Ichiraku is basically just the name of the restaurant in this one. So, yeah, because of how many dishes that Naruto brought to it. He also gets paid a lot more because he makes a lot more money off different foods. So, yeah. Also, with this, the economy in Naruto, there's like a whole book, I'm pretty sure, that talks about the economy stats. Konoha was actually one of the lowest, I believe. So, Konoha's economy, economy went from like a two to like a four. So, pretty good. But I think Cloud is still the most economic village at roughly around a five, I believe. But yeah, so next day we go into the bell test, and well, also Sasuke, Sasuke just trying to keep, up, trying to keep, up, trying to train to keep up, to keep up with Naruto, which did lead to him unlocking a two, not two twenty, but one twenty and two twenty shining on him, one in like each eye, one twenty in one eye, one two twenty in the other. Yeah, that whole thing going on still. Plus, he actually, actually copied Naruto, Naruto's, Naruto's type two too, but Naruto knew this when he used the basics, and Sasuke couldn't get past the basics. He doesn't doesn't know what martial art this is. So yeah. Well, Sasuke, Sasuke has had the charm gun for roughly around five months now, so he's, 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 he's experienced with the charm gun. He knows how to use it properly. But yeah, so you don't actually just see just Kakashi say star, only to have Naruto appear behind him holding the bells. And Kakashi isn't, is, 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 isn't too shocked. So Asuma did say, like, yeah, he tested his team, like, the day he got them. And Choji and, Sh- Choji and Shikamaru proved to actually be really fast. They're about, they're about as fast as... Basically, a light bomb, they're able, able to actually run and counter that the moment it's thrown. Like, they're able to counter it before it even explodes, and it's, it's exploding at the speed of light. So he's confused on how, how they got that fast, especially that Naruto may be even faster than that, which is which is true. Naruto's real reflexes surpass light speed. His regular speed, rivaling lightning. Kakashi would at least have to use Chidori to keep up with Naruto, because Chidori is allowed to use it to move at lightning speed. So, yeah. Also, also, Naruto does, is using the first two gates already, so his body is already getting enhanced by it. But what Naruto, Naruto ended up taking the stance you see here, right here, telling Kakashi that he can get up the bells back once, once, once their duel ends, because he wants to see how strong he is compared to a Jonin. He hasn't fought one in a long time. 
the Naruto and Kakashi engage in Taijutsu, and yes, Kakashi is stronger than Naruto with Taijutsu, but still, the moment, the moment he hits Naruto, he feels like he's hitting a, a giant tree, and Naruto isn't feeling any pain from this hit, from these hits, even Kakashi being playing out kunai, saying this is the best way to cause damage, but still, if he would stab Naruto, no blood would come out, his body's just too dense to pierce, but if he would block a punch and kept flying through the air, and you just realize that one of his arms is pretty, well, the bone itself is pretty badly bruised from this punch, but then suddenly Naruto appeared behind him, then Kakashi would immediately pull out the shower again, realizing that he would need this to dodge. When Naruto would stop holding back with his speed and strength, King Kakashi right in right the stomach and down to the ground. Kakashi the ground getting up, pulling on his mask, meant to throw up. Before trying to activate Chidori, he did it, did it, charged full speed at Naruto. What if Naruto dashed at him at the same speed, grabbed Kakashi's arm and twist it as he had used Chidori? As before, Naruto's fast as lightning, with reflexes faster than light. He can catch and throw Kakashi using Chidori like it's nothing. Like, if, if Naruto if Naruto's Naruto moving, moving at his full speed, he can see time in, like, slow motion. Kakashi's moving slow for him. Plus, plus Naruto's, Naruto's perception is really high already. So, yeah. So, he can cut off Kakashi moving in slow motion before catching his arm and throwing him into the air. And before Kakashi can even react and get a proper landing, Naruto ends up appearing, appearing where Kakashi would land, kicking one of his legs out, and kicking him right in, right in the chin, knocking him out. As Kakashi would hit the ground unconscious... I ended up panting, I mean, we're not end up panting, saying it's so hard to outpace the Sharon gun. And Kakashi did admit that Naruto did pretty well outpacing it, because Naruto has to outpace Sasuke's Sharon gun. But with Naruto's stats being at max power, well, he already knew how to, how to counter, uh, how to counter, how to outpace the Sharon gun, and then just began doing it even more. So, yeah, and Naruto, if we were to use his, use his, his perception normally, if you were to use his perception at its peak level, he's roughly around a two twenty shower gun in terms of in terms of like just perception. So he's better than Sasuke. His eyes are, and he doesn't even have a, have a dojutsu. Like, like so before, he strengthens everything else but his physical body because there's, there's nothing to strength to strengthen. His muscles are already at its peak level. He means strength, 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 strengthens all the senses, but then his endurance and reflexes, all that, are strengthened too. Also, Naruto is also insanely flexible. Like like he's like beyond the Nosuke flexible. <laughs> so yeah, uh, pause. Yeah, Naruto is just insanely flexible, kind of like, um, I guess the best way he can use his muscles, also a lot like Machi from, um, the Phantom Troop. I mean, he's, he's, been, he's, he's been even more, um, more um, flexible than Inosuke. And if you think again, after how that guy basically was able to, or more or less, just be, flexible, be so flexible, he can defend his, defend his pressure points and everything else. Naruto, Naruto, Naruto can do that too, he just means usually defend, he uses it to defend any part of his body, so if you hit it, well, you hit a giant ball of muscle and break your fingers on it, so, yeah. Or 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 or, or, or you could just cracks, but this is the best way to get past this is honestly using Senbone like Haku does. But you have to be really good at Senbone. So yeah, but land away's mission. So for land away, for land away's mission, well, um, well, the, one that, the, one that the demon the demon brothers appear. Not so honestly, just use like use the helmet, like the armor armor crushing kick as well, and just just cuts, just cuts one of them almost almost cleanly in half with that without how precise it was. So with almost, well, almost killing a demon brother, cutting him in half, well, the demon brother's down for the count. He's dead. Sasuke just dropped, just dropped the other one with Genjutsu, and then they interrogated him. So yeah. Well, on to Zabuza, where Naruto would end up using a new technique. It, now, now this technique is honestly just, um, what was it? Pretty sure it's called Thousand Penetrating Soaking Palm. Yeah. The Thousand Penetrating Soaking Palm. So when the blade would come into Naruto, he'd land it. Basically, basically you can just like do just a very fast jab. You know, it lands, all the shockwave, shockwave come out, and well, Zabuza will try to get the blade before the whole thing shatters, or before it can connect with Naruto. Once have the blade shatter, and him just get a giant shockwave right to the gut. But Kakashi not throwing, oh, Kakashi, Zabuza not throwing up. Before you actually just hear Naruto, hear Naruto say, third gate, gate of life, open. Yeah, Naruto found out about the gates actually, actually through Rock Lee, because him and Rock Lee have been meet to the through one month and a half of training. Yep, he, he kind of, kind of met Team Guy as a whole, because he, he works out a bit more than his team. So the moment the training ends, he, he just keeps on training. So he met all, all, all of Team Guy. Secondly, he copied Neji's gentle fist. But also Naruto uses the dozen jutsu from the school of healing. He uses, he, he, know, he, knows, he, knows, he knows the, the September Sangon, the Flying Raijin, the Reanimation Jutsu, the Chakon Jutsu, the most, the most Chakon Jutsu. Name a jutsu in the school of healing, he probably knows how to do it. Or at least knows basic hand seals for it. So yeah. So yeah. Also, he's training with the Flying Regin and Rasengan. So yeah. At this point, he actually, he actually can do Rasengan with two hands. Yeah, pause more time. Alright, so, uh, 
So his opposition is not just knock out this punch from the third gate, really. But also just, just the armor, the ar not the armor crushing, the, the thousand soaking palm. Would just also, also take him out in general. Haku, when you try to dash, will head towards, towards Naruto, to actually just avenge Zabuza. But Naruto already knew Haku was there, so he spun around before putting one finger on Haku's mask and swiping it. Actually cutting Haku's mask clean off, and actually only making a blood scar across Haku's face, and actually the blood would blind Haku's eyes for, for a bit. He made sure not to actually permanently blind Haku, he's not too much of a fan of permanent injuries, like blinding someone. But still, he, 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 he knew, he knew this had to be done for a second, but yeah. Haku by the ground turned just slash at Naruto using a sunbone, only to just realize that Naruto grabbed her, then flipped, then flipped him. I say her or him, I don't know. But I'm, 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 I'm trying to say like them or, them or they because, yeah, I don't, I, don't, I, don't, I don't care too much about Haku, Haku's identity in this one, so, yeah. But ha Haku, Haku realized that Naruto had grabbed their hand before flipping them, and then just elbowing them right in the gut, hard enough to knock them out. With Haku knocked out, he actually shocked shocked that Naruto dropped two S-rank shinobi like that and that fast. But this one Naruto says that he'll, he'll bring him back to Konoha. This will be the only, only big thought ahead. Uh, so he just nodded and said he's leaving now. But he then, he then yelled, then yelled fifth gate, gate of the limit, open. And disappeared with, with flames making, with his, with his feet making flame, uh, making flaming tracks. So yeah. So as he arrived in Konoha, he would disable fifth gate before dragging, dragging the, bring the two down to Konoha prison and leaving them in there. So yeah. With these two going to our prison, no, not to, not to, actually does say give them like like, like a full like a full like a full full full, full, full treatment because well one of them will have their face split open by Naruto and may actually die, not may not die but may actually be be, be permanently blinded. I got hit really hard in the gut and he wants to know if he would crush any vital organs and if they did, he 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 he's willing to donate some. <laughs> so yeah, it'd be really hard to really hard to donate anything actually to cut him open. That that is like even his skin really durable. So yeah. But Naruto honestly stays in Konoha for like the remainder of the mission as he solved any big problem they had. And he even came back not long after, so yeah. And Sakura was, was the only one who needed to learn, to learn how, to, how, to control, how to control Chakra, and she did it in a second. So yeah. Sasuke just learned learned it by accident by, by turning turn, 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 a Sharingan. Huh. <laughs> So, yeah. so we just move on to probably just the training exams. Now, actually, during this time, all the all the, all the good on teams actually be NBA and getting to know each other. Naruto hadn't happened to hang out with Rock Lee, Shikamaru, and Choji. Then the Neji walked up and said, Sorry, Hinata and Shino, because he's a, he's friends with those two. But then, then with everyone else looking, looking for their teammates, they'd all just just unite and they'd been talking. Yeah, Neji and Hinata got off on the wrong foot, then Kibo and Sasuke did as well. Then so did Ino and Sakura, but he calmed all that down immediately by flaming his chakra up. I've been saying that while they're here, no one, no one will be arguing or fighting, and no one actually actually has seen Naruto get angry besides Shikamaru and Choji, and he was angry, angry at himself at one point where he just punched a wall so hard, not a wall, but a mountain so hard that the whole cliffside fell off. So yeah, yeah, honestly, that happened to be one of the Hokage, like the Hokage monument, and then so part, of, like, part of like Minato's hair fell off and almost crushed Naruto until he caught it and threw it back up in the air, then just landed on top of there. So yeah, but. If you, if, you, if you go go to the academy, you just see a giant fist imprint on the wall. It seemed like it was made by a giant, but in reality, it was just a shockwave of Naruto's fist hitting it. And he's when he's like eight years old. <laughs> but yeah, all, all, all the Konoha team for around two weeks will be in training together. As they say, they, they all begin make, be making combos and strategies together. He said that they say that they may be they may be enemies in the future, but who cares? For now, for now, they they should they they, they prep for the best. And during this time, anyone who didn't 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 know. How to, how to control chakra, learn how to do it. Anyone, anyone who couldn't do any 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 ninjutsu, learn how to do it. Plus, Naruto had Naruto, Naruto, Naruto was actually able, able, to, able to make the bend, bend the relationship between um, Neji and Hinata. I said it a little too fast. He was able to mend the relationship between Neji and Hinata. I also started too much. My bad. But yeah. So Neji and Hinata are on good terms. Terms Sakura and Ino mend, mend, mend their whole, whole, whole relationship. And also, since he's even joined in training other 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 people's other people's teams, so yeah. Also, during this, during this two weeks, Sasuke also be in his own Chidori training a bit early. So yeah. Well, it already began during the month and a half because he already had, already had a showering gone. But yeah, but he, he, he honestly, honestly had had to learn how to use how to use a lightning release first because they had a lot more time before the tuning exams. 
Sasuke, Sasuke just, just can use the lightning, lightning, lightning ninja in general. But then Chidori is only jutsu. He knows, he knows how to do of it. So, yeah. But Naruto and also, Naruto, Naruto also, learned, also learned how to do lightning release as well. So, Naruto, at 13 years old, can use three natures. He can use wind, fire, and lightning. But then also, with how much did, how much did Hugo are training, plus he actually wanted to know how, how, how Naruto got so strong to the point where she even beat Hanabi and getting close to Neji's power, Neji mentions Naruto and how much of a taijutsu genius he is. So he actually doesn't want to meet Naruto, so patiently would invite him to the compound, but the Hokuhan 12 would arrive. He actually would see how strong they all are with taijutsu, ninjutsu, and everything. You are amazed at Naruto, at Naruto alone. Naruto, Naruto in terms of martial arts. He would know, basically, his Chinese Kempo, Kali Arnis, his Krav Maga, Muay Thai, Jiu-Jitsu, Taekwondo, Boxing, Wing Chun, Jeet Kune Do, Tai Chi, Sumo Wrestling, Judo, and Korean Wrestling. Plus, 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 plus the Gentle Fist. That's just how good Naruto is at martial arts. He knows that many martial arts. Plus, he's a, plus he, he already knew street fighting because that's how he does it. So, yeah. Pause. So, with all, with all those martial arts, well, the Hugo would be surely amazed and actually be teaching Naruto a few of their techniques to see if he can copy it perfectly like he did the Gentle Fist. At least the basics of it. Now, Naruto, with his sheer speed and strength, is actually able to somewhat decently do the palm rotation technique. But that's about it. He couldn't. He couldn't do um do um sixty four palms. But honestly, he already knew where all knew where all chakra points were, and he just tapped one of them, then flowed chakra into it at max speed and killed them. That's, that's how he told them he didn't didn't need that need that technique. He just can just kill them like that. He has so much chakra. He has, he has so much chakra anyway. And when also how much he trains, he also grew his reserves to the to an insane limit. No limit actually. There's no limit to how much chakra you can have. He has basically infinite. But yeah. Hell, even Shimura and Choji have insane amounts of chakra because they train with Naruto so often. But yeah, now we're going to Konkuro and the whole, Kon the whole Konohamaru and Konkuro thing. Now, Konkuro is about to punch Konohamaru in the face. This punch, this punch would, end up, would end up being blocked by, by Inata just telling him that he should drop Konkuro. Not Konkuro, she, he should drop Konohamaru. Konkuro actually blushes at Hinata's sight, the sight of Hinata, and he says, Oh, yeah, 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 no problem, sorry. Listen to this, he's a grandson of Third Okage. And immediately, Konkuro's jaw dropped, and then started Samaris. But suddenly, you know, they end up, end up hearing Gara, Gara growling at something. Before Gara appeared in front of them with a sand drawn and sit in shape of blades. So Rock Lee and Sasuke appeared in front of him and sort of Neji. Now, with these two weeks of training, Rock Lee learned to actually go beyond the fourth gate into the sixth. Sasuke and, and, and Neji, well, Sasuke went with the first gate, that's all he needed, actually. First gate clears up any, 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 any mental, mental restraint or strain. Then, well, for Neji, he learned he learned his first and second gate as the first strength increased to be good for him. He didn't need any more speed. He's already, he's already fast as is. So, yeah. So with this, well, one, Sasuke actually, actually, when he came to Itachi, he's a bit more subtle on that thought. Then, when it comes to, when it comes to Neji's, well, strength and speed, he actually grew to actually be roughly around the around the level of a high tuning, maybe even low joning. So yeah. And now at this point, all the all all the, all the Konoha Twelve are capable of at least dropping, like they're all capable of being beyond tuning level. With well, 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 like order of strength, like strongest to weakest, Naruto, Neji, Sasuke. Shuminoshu. No, not so Rock Lee, Neji, Sasuke. Shockingly, Shikamaru. This is, this is like the rank of strongest to weakest. Uh, uh, well, this is like the strongest of the group, but yeah. Then Choji below Shikamaru. So, yeah. Hinata is actually, actually still pretty powerful, but when it comes to the ones I just named, she can't really get a touch, get to, like, touch them. When it comes to Choji, it's hard to even like, just make him feel anything because just how durable he is. But yeah. I go on to the whole test thing. Naruto actually, they all pass that pretty easily because they can all cheat perfectly. So yeah, so they all passed it, and roughly actually they all made they all know they all made like decent decent time. But Naruto did Naruto did the fastest, because his perception on level of Sharingan, so he got as long as he copied off Sakura. But then when it came to Sakura, she can in, in, answer the tenth question, so he could be in copying off anyone else and blending answers. Eventually one of the blends came the right answer, and he actually got the same score as Itachi. So done. He's not a genius, just fast. So with this, we'll turn in this paper. And we'll, well, Ibiki, not Ibiki, Ibiki. Let me check. Yes, yeah, Ibiki. So, Ibiki would just, would just realize that not everything right. Then eventually he would just, he would just leave. He, he, he waits at the force of death until the 12 arrive. They arrive. Well, they all, they all just be in training there. But Anko does question how they all got there really fast. He says that they work as a unit, they don't work in, as individual teams. Even though they can, they can work, they can work perfectly. 
but they're all they're also so good as, as a whole unit in general. So Anko Anko having like an like another two hours to waste on this on just anything. You should really break down how it worked and then told them that they can that they can just wait here at their scrolls. But then she ends everyone else their scrolls. Well, she they, they, they like they have to start when everyone else does, just so it's a fair it's a fair start. But still, they have their scrolls and they know how everything works. So I'm sure when she does say start when other teams arrive, they move in the forest, but they're all as one unit. This is how it works. Not 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 only the north guarding the north, east, and west. Then we have you have Neji Neji in the east, east. Um, so with Neji in the east, Sasuke in the west. Then actually in the back we have we have Kiba and Shino. In the middle we have everyone else. Hinata is in the middle with is mainly the one in the middle in the middle with Ibiakun activated. But suddenly Neji ends up, ends up yelling there's a giant snake heading towards them. Hinata says Hinata says that she sees it. But before she can do anything to it, Susi not Susi not up here in front of it before hitting the snake quickly inside of the head, killing it. Suddenly, he has to look up, seeing Orochimaru flying down towards them. Only see Sasuke appear, firing a fireball jutsu at him. Then he hears Kiba yell Fang over Fang, slamming to Orochimaru's side. But Orochimaru is able to take a lot of the damage. But when he lands, he realizes that, that, that they pooped in the clone, doing that it was a clone between Akamaru and Kiba. Suddenly, he's first grabbed from underground, he's pulled underground. Only he's kicked right in the chin by Sasuke. Then Orochimaru just gets a combo from Choji with palm strikes and then eventually a body slam. Then Shikamaru would end up deciding decide to, to use his most his most lethal lethal lethal, lethal technique. The coon, not the coon. That sounds so weird. <laughs> the coon, fucking, I'm dumb. The kuunju. Shikamaru basically ends up rubbing Orochimaru's arm really quickly. Shikamaru just uh, not Shikamaru. Orochimaru just questions this and so does everyone else besides besides Naruto and Choji. Before they see Orochimaru's arm basically burst out in blood, but, well, his, the blood in his arm bursts out everywhere, so he screams in pain. The Ku Unju basically just you scrub the muscles to the point where they all just break apart. They, just, they basically just shred apart. But Shimuro does it to the point where even the skin sh- is shredded apart. But Shimuro yells in pain, and I'm not being able to move his arm. Four Naruto ends up landing in front of him, then pulling him out of the ground swiftly before just going into the fifth gate. And then quickly, quickly snatching, not snatching, not snatching, but hitting every single pressure point and chakra point that Oshimaru has. How much more hits the ground? He's just paralyzed and foaming at the mouth. That's how fast they beat Orochimaru. It took 10 minutes. A squad of Genin beat Orochimaru in 10 minutes with sheer tricks. One of them, one of them using skill, but yeah. Well, three of them using, using skill, but yeah. Now that they leave, they, are, they also are, are obviously a whole unit. And then they can find anything they need, and they take down anything they need. Plus, if, 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 it's, if it's just... Well, like, Kiba can drop most teams in the forest besides Team Gara and Team Dosu single handedly. It doesn't like if Kiba, Kiba can drop a team by by himself. It's not it's not that sh- it's not that hard to get scrolls. So if they, if they see a team but they don't want to do it, send out Kiba and he'll drop the whole team. So and they they, they they actually beat Team Gara's record at roughly around they give the team this whole unit gets around thirty minutes. Team Gara came there six minutes later, seeing everyone there. But yeah, they spend the whole five days in their room just chilling. They also, they also do train a bit, so, yeah. Also, Sakura and Sake begin getting a bit a bit closer. Then Todu, Ino, and, well, shockingly, Kiba. But she kind of just trying to make it a bit annoying, but, yeah. Well, but if not trying to make true, not getting like, close to anyone, just doing one arm put, not one arm, one finger push-ups, all in a handstand formation. So, yeah. This would originally break his finger, but with how much pressure his body can withstand, it, it, wouldn't, it wouldn't break his finger whatsoever, actually, so, yeah. But then we have the whole um, whole preliminaries, and uh, yeah, so we have Sasuke versus Yoroi. Yoroi, Yoroi will, will try to absorb Sasuke's chakra, but honestly, he doesn't work out too well at all. The one, the one Yoroi tried to fight Sasuke, he thought he had the curse mark already, not realizing that Orochimaru has been beaten by Sasuke. The one Yoroi tried to actually grab Sasuke and absorb his chakra. Well, honestly, Sasuke just ended up smirking, saying, "Hey, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know why my eyes are better, are better than yours." Not even using shotgun, Sasuke just snatched out Yoroi's eyes like it's nothing, then he kicked him right in the chin hard enough to knock him out. So yeah, Sasuke did that to Yoroi. Then, then we have Shino versus Zaku. Honestly, the moment Zaku tried to fire like whole black at Shino, Shino just tanked it as he was taught as he was taught martial art by Naruto in Kyokushin Karate. Naruto didn't know Kyokushin too well, but he recently learned it from just yeah, he can learn it. Shino's body is a bit more durable before he appeared in front of Zaku. Then him in the him in the chest of Hardy caved it in. Shino's strength grew insanely high because of the Hyuga, but also Naruto. And then Kanko versus Shirugi goes the exact same way. Kanko versus Ino. Sakura's physical strength and her speed, plus her Genjutsu's tactics, actually beat Ino. 
So yeah, you know, you know, you know, it did do good, but Sakura still beat her. We have Tenten versus Tamari. Actually, Tenten actually almost beat Tamari, but Tamari's fan, fan like the third move was what, was what it took to beat to beat Tenten. But but Tenten fights over. Tamari's covered in bit of scratches, bruises, even even having a kunai or two sticking out of her body. But she's insanely tired from this. Then we're showing her skin. The one she tried to use again, Jutsu, he already broke out of it, then appeared in front of her, before kicking her right in the throat, so that it made her choke on her own blood and pass out. She didn't die, but she passed out from kicking the throat. But, yeah. Not no, no, for Kiba. All I honestly did was just grab Kiba by the nose and break it, and then Kiba just yelled in pain and submitting. And then he kicked Kiba's nose back in place. But, yeah. He had for Sneji, shockingly. He not actually won that fight. Honestly, because she, she, she didn't spend time shrinking her body, she went time bettering her speed and her Byakugan range. So she actually saw a lot of a lot of Neji attacks coming from far away, and she beat him up. But Neji did shut down a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot of her chakra points, but he also did say that she loses the fight. She won't, she won't be in good shape for a long time after this. But so Neji's coughing up blood, and then, then Neji's already unconscious. So fight is counted as a draw. So yeah, I think Gara versus Rock Lee. Gara won that fight. Honestly, he abused Gara even more than he did in canon. Like, like, Rock Lee shot into the fifth gate, and then kicked Gara right, and right in the face, full force, almost breaking Gara's skull. So, yeah. Maybe he beat Gara. Toji versus Dosu. Um, Toji just honestly was slapping Dosu around like he was a rag doll. Literally and metaphorically, actually, but, yeah. By the time the fight's over, Toji's covered in a bit of bru- bruises, but that's about it, while Dosu's covered in broken bones. So, yeah, so Dos- Dosu lost that fight pretty horribly. So, yeah. So after this, we go on to the one with the training. We're going to talk about Jiraiya. Jiraiya tried to teach, tried to teach, teach, Naruto, teach, Naruto, teach Naruto summoning. Forgetting that Naruto already knew summoning due to the fact that Naruto, 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 Naruto summoned some of his we- weapons because of the Tenten. She taught him how to do that. Naruto mainly uses a staff and nunchucks, so, yeah. So, he, he already knew summoning. Jutsu just summoning on the Munta first try. And, uh, yeah, he did pretty good. After this, we can move on. Probably just try to try to teach Naruto the Rasengan. But not that he said he memorized the scroll of healing and already knew knew how to do a sun gun. So he learned, learned, learned one hand and that shocked Jiraiya. Next up, I mean, next up, flying Raijin. Then again, he forgot the far, the far, the, 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 the scroll of healing and memorized it. Boom. All, 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 all he needs to do is practice, 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 practice flying Raijin the whole month and he did just that, mastering flying Raijin. Not mastering it, but doing, doing it pretty pretty well at it. Can't tell me to the Jutsu, but me answered it better. In Naruto, shockingly, it was around to be on level with a flying Raijin. So, dope. Naruto, I don't know, Naruto, at the end of the month, had already surpassed Mo, Mo Shinobi. He's beyond Jonin level. He already was at, was at 12 years old. Or 13, but yeah. Tomorrow for Shikamaru. Shikamaru's with a bit, a bit better drive as a Shinobi, but also just a better strength in overall Jutsu. Plus, of course, healing taught him a bit of Nara, bit of Nara for Bidden Jutsu. He slapped Tamari around like a rag doll. So, yeah. We then talked for Shigara. I don't think I don't think I said um said Naruto said Naruto said Naruto, said Naruto, 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 Naruto One tapped. Yeah, Neji actually 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 was counted as someone who needed a fight in training exam, so it was not it was Naruto it was Naruto, Naruto versus Neji. He one tapped Neji. So yeah. Then Sasuke versus Gara. The fight ended so quickly that it wasn't even a fight. Well, Sasuke's not perfecting Chidori. The one that Gara tried to attack no no Naruto tried to attack Sasuke. Boom, Chidori Senbo. Gara stabbed repeatedly until he just gets, a, gets his story slapped into the arena wall. Gara, that fight ended so quickly that Gara didn't even know what happened. Gara, well, Gara was also knocked out, so he was Sasuke the, the winner until Gara ended up turning into, into Shukaku. But then Shukaku arrived, Naruto just ended up smirking at Shukaku, saying this is his fight, everyone else butt out. Sasuke so nodded, saying he'll sing he'll, 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 Shinobi, and everyone else, everyone else just, just, just gets back up saying that they, they can do it too. Even an injured Hinata and Rotten Rock Lee with one shattered arm was able to actually do this. Also, you guys wondering why Gara and Sasuke fought? Honestly, Rock Lee had, had like, Gara shattered Rock Lee's arm because he, he tried to use sand coffin. And that shattered Gara's, oh, not Gara, shattered Rock Lee's arm, but Gara also also had his skull cracked open, but he's in Cherokee, so he recovered a bit faster. So then they couldn't have, they can have two people be just drawn out, so honestly... Neji and um and Gara were selected as, as just, just to go on because that's who they wanted to see fight. They didn't know who Rock Lee was, but they knew who Gara was. They didn't, they didn't know who they didn't they didn't care about Hinata. They cared about Neji, so they they, they were they, they were selected to fight. But yeah, but we should go to Naruto to Naruto, to Naruto for Shikaku. So yeah, 
But even 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 Rockley 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 with one arm and in, in, he's not trying to beat down everyone in, the, everyone in their path. So yeah. But not just not not just not, not just Sashikaku and didn't, didn't wasn't even intimidated by him. All Naruto did was go to was going to the seventh gate before actually saying that this jutsu is probably the strongest one. Well, none of this is a lie because he does he doesn't know how to use the eighth gate yet. Even though he well he does but doesn't use it because he doesn't know he has it. He shot him to the gate, partially actually reached punch in the air. Here, well, it was a very swift punch, but it created a giant pocket in the air. The pocket of air created, well, honestly, was it just... What animal animal would this punch make? This guy makes makes a bike to polar bear, I believe, or an elephant. I forgot, but I'm pretty sure it's a polar bear. Or a tiger. I'm pretty sure it's a tiger, actually. Hmm. So, I'm going to decide that Naruto honestly just does a giant ox, because that seems a bit more fitting. Because Naruto is is literally stronger than an ox, but he he he's common. People commonly refer to him as strong as an ox. So now Naruto Naruto, Naruto, Naruto Naruto punch the air swiftly as a giant ox will come out. It's then right into Shikaku. When Shikaku gets hit by the ox, it's split in half. Now Naruto ends up appearing appearing just right in front of Gara. I'm sorry, in front of Gara, but I'm on top, on top of Shikaku's head before he's palm striking it. Really, really seeing Gara, then he knocks out, knocks out, but wakes up Gara. Then talk to Gara on how on how like how he's in jerky as well, knows about the hate and everything. But he went over well, well, he went over Konoha. Tells Gara that all he needs to do is went over, went, went over Tunagakure, and Gara's life could be really good too. Gara nodded, and then Gara is just now actually wanting to decide to actually well first he realizes that Rats is probably dead because Orochimaru was disguised as the fourth, as the fourth uh, Tsuchikage, the fourth the fourth Kazakage. And she began announcing that. That's as soon as soon as Gakure will kill all those all the hidden town hidden town shinobi, and they'll be become little ally themselves with the hidden leaf. Gar seemed a bit different, a bit more confident, but also a bit more calm. So as soon as Gakure kind of out r- rallied around this, and she began killing Shun Sound 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 Ninja. Well, she jumped up in the air before powering up to the, up to the seventh gate again, punching the barrier so hard that the whole thing was destroyed. But that my guy didn't catch him. Then the Ambu, been fighting over Shimaru. Shimaru has been training for the whole month. Bushmaru was still, well, he didn't, he wasn't stronger than Hiderzen, but he's still really strong, and stronger than Kanan. Then Kakashi, Guy, and four Ambu joining in made it even harder as he's defeated. Then Kabuto would eventually jump in, before, actually, well, Final Sound 4, and, and, um, Sound 4 and, uh, fucking Kabuto jump in. Kabuto actually ends up pumping Hiderzen right in the chest, and Hiderzen ends up coughing up blood, wondering what, what juice this is. And Kakashi and Guy were to, were to, were to shock actually, actually do anything else besides the Besides defending and defending the pen against, but but trying to heal Peter's in. This time for actually actually hey, we catch catch Ambu off guard because Ambu are Ambu are all potter, they're killed. Kabuto escapes with with Orochimaru and the time for escape escapes as well. But then well, this honestly ends in the battle that will that will Konoha wins. Asuna offer up the strongest healing ninjas again healing Peter's in. is knocked into a coma still, not still, but he's not in a coma in this one. He's not dead. Not until he starts to become Okage. But Naruto, Naruto, Naruto doesn't have a good feeling about Donzo. But the elders, I, I actually do say if Donzo does become, become Hokage, he has, to, he has to make Naruto a Jonin. He's a very good asset. Not realizing he would have to do that, because the elders, he doesn't, he's not too keen on becoming Hokage anymore. <laughs> but immediately they decide to search, to search for Hokage, with Naruto and Dry going out to find Tsunade. As they go to find Tsunade, well, they actually bring along Neji, because he's actually still in pretty good shape. Well, see, he, he's a good, he's, he, he's a good, good sentry ninja. <sighs> But we go to Naruto, to Naruto and Neji, Neji in the hotel room, as Dry's kind of out, quote unquote, gathering information. Before we actually see Neji jump in, uh, Neji, Itachi and Itachi and Kisame try to, knock on, try, to knock, try to knock on the door. And then Neji called out, it was two, it was two Kosuke members, and one of them had a showering gun. With that, no, 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 and the doors were an inch thick. Four inch punch. Suddenly, Naruto not, 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 not executed this before the shockwave would shoot, shoot Kisame and, and Itachi far back. Kisame put his head, put his some hot in front of him and Itachi. Something hot has a giant fist imprint on it. Kisame and Spurk saying, What kind of monster is that kid? Before Naruto ended up saying, saying, Hey, saying, hey Neji, go find Jiraiya. Neji and Jiraiya turned out the window as Kisame tried to say Neji because he was going to get Jiraiya. Only we kicked right in the chest by Naruto and flying back into the hotel. Naruto's raw power is roughly on the level of around the around, around the six tails in raw power. That's how strong he is with using with using all gates to surpass his Kurama. So dope. 
So with Kurama, if he, if he were to, if he were to just use his own power against Kurama, he'd need at least at least the eighth gate to beat him. But yeah, seventh gate could give him a bit of an edge, but not beat him. The best the, the seventh gate would make him it would make him rival would make him rivals rivals with Yuki or Chome, one of the two. But still, the best the best he, he, he'd read he'd, he'd between like he'd be between seven and eight tails level. That's about it with the seventh gate. Eighth gate is where he surpasses everyone in existence. So yeah, but yeah, uh, we should go on to Naruto fighting against Kisame and Tachi. As Naruto ends up shooting the seventh gate to fight them both and does beat them both actually shockingly. But some of the time, the multi-thought of his knees panting, coughing up blood even. But Dra Dra would arrive seeing Naruto have beaten Itachi and Kisame. But Naruto is all is, looks, 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 looks like he's missing half of his arm, <laughs> and he is telling me how to bit it off. He's he, he to punch Kisame. Kisame would have blocked it, blocked it, blocked it, blocked Naruto's punch with Samihata, only because Samihata's almost punched in half by Naruto. Samihata reached around biting Naruto at the, around the shoulder level before biting Naruto's whole arm off and then swallowing it to get get more chakra. Samihata's power is boosted a lot, even Kisame's chakra's power is boosted, but 7th gate Naruto punched a hole through Kisame, killing him. And then, almost killing him before Samihata had swallowed him, but he doesn't know what happened. He almost thought Kisame escaped, but Samihata just ate Kisame, then just was, was letting him heal. Well, well Tachi was honestly just beaten up by Naruto. Hell, even even the Susano was shattered by Naruto's raw strength. The driver ended up, ended up bringing Naruto to the doctors. So he actually would put Samihata in a scroll. Then Itachi is also, also just arrested. But yeah, so actually just has just has, just has Neji bring Itachi back the hidden leaf and chains. And then he also put a seal on Itachi's eyes. So yeah, so Itachi brought him to come on, put it in jail. But Sasuke would see Neji bringing in Itachi and a giant scroll. Yeah, he, he has, he has, Sasuke would ask Neji how Itachi was beaten. Even Kakashi was beaten, and by, by Itachi, but Sanji says, "Oh, no, 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 Naruto is pretty badly injured right now. So eventually, Naruto is brought back to Konoha, but after around two weeks. Guys, guys are wondering why two weeks. So Sunday, Sunday kind of built a prosthetic for Naruto. So yeah. But then eventually, Sunday would get to Konoha before 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 using a um using Hashirama cells to make Naruto a whole new arm. So yeah. Then we go, then we go on to Sasuke recovery mission, and Sasuke still doesn't go with Orochimaru. Because Naruto beat Itachi, he didn't. And that just actually make him. That, made, that did make him a lot of, make him very jealous of Itachi, but not Itachi, but of Naruto, and now tries to beat Naruto, not, not Itachi. But yeah, he also he also just plan on backstabbing um, um Naruto, not Naruto, but Orochimaru at the same time. So he'll oh, she'll train train with Orochimaru until he thinks he's strong enough to beat Naruto, and then just backstab him, literally and 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 metaphorically. So. But we go into the sound four versus um team seven. Well, the Konoha twelve actually. No, the whole the whole Konoha eleven actually, because Sasuke left. But they're chasing, they're chasing, they're chasing it for Sasuke. First fight would, would be against we would be against Jirobo, but Choji says he'll handle this fight pretty easily. Honestly, Choji got full power, not even, not even using the using the pills. Jirobo would need to go to that to would go need to go at least full power to even compare to that to that level that to Choji to using that much power. If Choji Choji can use can use the whole the whole Butterfly mode without any, though any like pills that whatsoever. So hmm. the pills just amp him up, amp him up. So he beat Drobo at full power, and Drobo even went all out and showed you he was in was in was in, butter, was in, was in butter, butterfly mode and killed the Drobo. He fight Kitomaru. Oh, those those, those Neji and those Neji and, and Hinata's fight completely, and Neji's second gate killed Kitomaru. Yeah, he he shut down a, a lot of a lot of Kitomaru chakra points, and then just, 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 just Neji in second gate killed him. So yeah. After that, second on Ukon. So we have three members Kona 12 at three members Kona 11 out. So Kona 11, 10, 9, 8. They have we need, we need two more second on Ukon individually. So then we then go, then go to Kona, Kona 6, and I'm going to say Kiba. I'm going to say probably probably just Kiba and um, Shino. Kiba and Shino combined fight against against um, against second on Ukon. And Shino actually 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 the first gates actually remove any mental mental strain himself. Actually, because he wanted, wanted more bugs, but didn't like their nature of it. Then him in first gate, but she'd be a bit more comfortable with it. 
So when he when he got the, we got the we got the, all, all more bugs, he killed he killed Sakon pretty easily just by touching him, and that turned him purple, and then Sakon died. So yeah, and Kiba killed killed Ukon by Ukon pretty easily. And then after that, it kind of just ends the whole sound four. What it next up is Ta- Tayuya, but um, honestly, that fight isn't isn't gonna go anywhere. Shikamaru would just step up and kill her in seconds. That's how it works for Shikamaru. He's killed like two people by far by already, and he and he's thirteen. Man, he's thirteen. Killed three people. It's easy for him. He's 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 he's, he's very scary. Yeah, Tayu is just killed 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 by Shikamaru, and he just joined up with everyone else. I like, like this is hard to see how Shikamaru would fare against her, and he, he kick her kick her so hard, and her neck is split open. So yeah. So five members of Clan on Twelve that are all at this point. Well, was well, not his approval. No, it was now a Jonin. Just, let, me, let me make a list real. All right. So the ranks of everyone in the Clan on Twelve. Before, before, let me do this before before they have to fight Kimi Maru. Naruto, Jonin, and if, he, if this mission goes well, well, not if this mission. By the time the mission's over, he he will, he will be an Amu captain. Sasuke, if he, if he were to, if he would have stayed in Konoha, special Jonin. Shikamaru, Anbu as well, part of Naruto's squad. Choji, Jonin, the the butterfly, the bu- the bu- the butterfly. I'm gonna give him, give him an edge, so he's a Jonin now. Neji, Jonin, is it battle IQ and sheer skill? Jonin worthy. Hinata, Chunin, Sakura, Chunin, Kiba, Chunin. Or do I need even do I even need need to explain why they're Chunin? Yeah, Hinata could have been a Chunin if she, not Chunin. She could have been a Jonin if she had as good a battle IQ as Neji did. So yeah. Shino, Anbu. With all with all the bugs and the Abrami clan that are, that, the, that he has, he's beyond most Jonin. He's he he may even even be, be, be beyond Kakashi because if Kakashi would touch him, he would die. So yeah. Lee Jonin, he has seven gates. There's no reason he shouldn't be a Jonin. Ten ten special Jonin, but depending on what weapon you give her, she will kill you. So yeah, give her, give her a certain certain weapon and she will dominate. Eno Jonin, do I even do I even need, need to say why? Wait, wait, Eno's not a Jonin. So yeah. Now I think I think those are all pretty fair rankings. We have so Kimaru. Kimaru being showing off pretty impressive skill, but Rock Lee said he'll fight, so said he'll fight him. At this point, all all that's left would be Naruto, Shikamaru, Shiko, Naruto, Shikamaru, um, uh, fucking Sakura. So Naruto, Shikamaru, Sakura, Lee, and Tenten and Ino. And, 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 and Lee said that, said that they could take this fight. And due to Lee not being on any medication, but his arm is still broken. He didn't he didn't, didn't have he didn't have, have surgery yet. Like his arm was already healing pretty well. So Sonny just said that give a bit more time and then it'll she'll once it's, once it's like after like a, after like another month, she'll be able she'll be, she'll be a, a, able, able, able to perform a faster surgery on, on, on Lee and he'll he took that option. So but yeah. So Lee and Tenten are actually able just combined are able to throw throw hands to Kimaru on equal tur- on equal turf without going all out. And Tenten was had to go all out herself, and Kimaru is being pushed, even 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 having his having his arm seriously injured. But then suddenly Rock Lee ends up going into the fifth gate, kicking off his whole arm, and then kicking him right in the chest, caving it in. But then his his body didn't die because he went to, went full power, only just to get one inch punch right in the throat and killed by by fifth gate Rock Lee. But before he fully died, Tenten will pull out a sword, cutting off his head cleanly, so he, so he doesn't doesn't regenerate from that too. So yeah, he's dead now. With that, with that, with all that's left would be Naruto, Shikamaru, Sakura, and Ino. Naruto, Shikamaru, Sakura, and Ino. Yep, that, that, that works. Yep, Naruto, Shikamaru, Sakura, and Ino. Naruto, Shikamaru, Sakura, and Ino. Four of them. Nope. So with this, we can just go on to uh, probably just Naruto and them versus uh, Sasuke. Sasuke would go in the second gate as he'd fight he'd fight Shikamaru, Sakura, and Ino. He does beat them, but still Shikamaru's, Shikamaru's Chinese Kimbo would actually land a few fatal blows on Sasuke if the Chris Rank didn't, didn't help him stay alive through him. But he still did beat them. And also up to him versus Naruto. As him and, as him and Naruto were to fight, suddenly Naruto's hit in the back by something. We get Konkuro's palm. Well, Konkuro. We get Kabuto's palm. I think there's the chakra's green, thinking it was a healing ninjutsu. Leaves will fall to the ground, coughing up blood. 
Kabuto says he developed a special jutsu just for Naruto. Naruto asked him who this was, but he says that it was a ripoff of Shikamaru's Kuunju jutsu. Where basically the muscles are shredded apart. But this time, Kabuto cut them into pieces. And cut the muscles, cut Naruto, the muscles in Naruto's body from his from basically basically just oh, like just very really soft hits. Cut the legs, cut the muscles in Naruto's legs and around, 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 around like the, the height, like I guess like the tricep around that area, or bicep. I mean not tricep, bicep muscles and then the, like all like most of the leg muscles. Naruto fell down. I mean not being really being able to get up. And Naruto is like killing Naruto, but before the fight continues, Sasuke is dragged away, not dragged away, but brought away by by, by Shimaru and Kabuto. But what does Naruto, what does Naruto, what does Naruto jump right at him? He gets like a blood, like, just stabbed right, right, right in the heart by by Orochimaru. Naruto is coughing up blood for before 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 the blades pulled out, and he fell the ground coughing up blood. Now Shikamaru would, uh, would end up be yelling Naruto's name. And everyone else, uh, everyone would hear would hear Shikamaru yelling if, for Naruto. They arrive, which is not actually part of his team, just because Rock Lee, Rock Lee might might hurt himself in the mission. So we saw Naruto and realized that this, fight, this mission was a little bit too hard. Bishi Man healing Naruto, but I think he's already healing himself. Got got up saying, nah, bastard, those cheap tricks. But suddenly, suddenly, Shinji says the mission the mission was a fail, but they still got, got a lot of valuable, valuable information, because some of the Sound 4 were still alive. With that, with that, they're interrogated, and, uh, yeah. Only ones that are alive is actually just, just Ukon, because Kiba didn't kill him. It's literally just Ukon and, um... Yeah, yeah, they yeah, just Ukon. Second one, second one was killed, but killed, was killed in one touch by Shino. But Shino just stayed behind to make sure Kiba, Kiba was okay. <laughs> but yeah, in the village, well, they all get their signed ranks of Naruto Nar- 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 becoming an Amu captain with the team consisting of Sai, Shikamaru, Shino. This is this is Amu team, but then eventually Kakashi would join because he has no students left. So Kakashi and then Yen Yamato join the team as well with Naruto being the captain. But the right-hand man of him would be, would be Shino, not Shino, I mean, would be, would be Shikamaru. And the left hand being Kakashi, then just made up of miscellaneous, miscellaneous ninja besides Yamato and Kabuto. Not Kabuto. Yamato and, and Sai. So, yeah. Now we go over the past four three years. Naruto's now 16. And, well, honestly, um, yeah. Naruto took two weeks off the Ambu to learn Sage Mode, but he learned it in four days. So, yeah. He mastered it in four days too, so he had four days total to, to, to learn stage mode. And Dry eventually eventually lasted it too, but took him took him one year. But, eh. Mainly, mainly, mainly not mainly not, not, not to help Dry to learn it to master it. So yeah. So with this, we fast we fast forward on to probably just probably probably just like the Kazakage Chuo mission, but Naruto 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 doesn't go. Honestly, he just sends out Sakura, Lee, and Tenten. So he's not thinking they can handle it. And they can. Sakura's Sakura stronger than she is in canon. She's trained by the Hyuga, Tsunade, and Kakashi still. Plus, also Kurenai. Kurenai, Kakashi, the Hyuga clan, and Tsunade. They all train Sakura. They all train the Konoha 12. Hell, she's trained by every Konoha, since, every, really, every Konoha 12 sensei, and the Hyuga, and Tsunade. That's how strong she is. Everyone in Konoha 12 is at, is at least low Kage level at this point. Hell, even Tenten and Ino and Sakura are low Kage. But yeah, like imagine the the, the, the digital fist with high level strength. That's how that's how, that's how Sakura operates. So yeah, we came to the mission. Well, we go on to just on to Sakura healing um Konkuro, and then the whole whole barrier thing. Now I'll send it into my shadow clones that she learned how to do that just to just to fight fight more efficiently. Now clones all fight all fight all fight other clones only to Sakura just punch down the whole whole wall with just like this one slap. So yeah, then it was her it was her and Chio versus versus Sasori. But, but Chio didn't expect, didn't expect Sakura to use the gentle fist, and she beat Sasori into the dirt with no effort. So yeah. So yeah, all all took Chio's puppets to take down Sasori's army puppets, and Sakura just beat down Sasori by by herself. And then we'd have we have just just um. We have we have we have Deidara left. Deidara versus Lee is honestly a complete mop for Lee. Lee has now mastered eight gates user. He can use all eight gates by himself. He's about as strong as he is in Boruto, shockingly. Yeah, the Hugo, the Hugo and all Konosantes give him a run, give him a good bit of power. Yeah, so Lee, Lee, Lee fight Datara and he abused Datara. So it took up to six gates to kill Datara, but yeah. Sasori is then interrogated in Konoha, then they get, they get the information on Tenichi, Tenichi Bridge, then Sasori dies. So yeah. 
So then Tanishi Bridge mission will happen with Naruto, Sai, and Yamato. And actually, I'm gonna say I'm gonna say Shino attend as well. Tomorrow is just watch just just watch, watch, watching watching from a distance. Then when the mission begins, well they all jump in. Because because Kabuto found out found out Yamato. Yeah, 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 Yamato already already, already, already expected this as a horde of bugs to shoot out from his whole from his whole like uh Hiroko puppet copy. Before before Kabuto can get far enough away, his arm is grabbed by Shino, and realizes his arm is repaired before he cut off his arm. He cut off his arm. Only just get elbowed right 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 in the neck by Naruto and have it broken. He's not he's not that's finished, but he, he's not paralyzed from the neck down. Suddenly, Naruto not just punched punch in the face by someone, and he stops flying far, just very far away. He lands on his feet, just like his broken nose. He's, working, uh, he's, he's never been hit that hard, even by Sakura. The other thing who did it, Senor Shimaru, he sort of, sort of looks, looks a bit different. He's sort of smirking as he suddenly he had activated a Sage One for the first time. A snake Sage One, actually. And Naruto realized why Why Shimaru seems stronger. He's a Sage. But after the smirking, saying, saying, I'm a Sage as well, going as he went into perfect Sage Mode. Toad Sage One for Naruto. It's not a, 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 battle, a battle between Sages. Only just Orochimaru's getting mopped completely. This fight is not fair for Orochimaru whatsoever. Also, just during this time, Naruto Nar 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 got bored trying to master the Nine Tails' power, with and without KCM. He can go, he can go from One Tails all the way to turn into the Nine Tails completely with still be, still being in control. As we've seen, he, he can do that, but without control, he turned into he turns like the Nine Tails, but didn't have any skin or fur. But then this Naruto can, can add fur and skin, so he's the full Nine Tails with, with control of it. But he also has KCM because he was bored. He met Minato, that went the same way as in canon, but he didn't hit Minato because he might kill him. <laughs> Kushin and Kushin is amazed at how, how durable Naruto was. Like, she hugged him, and I thought like she was hugging a tree. So, yeah. She's amazed with Naruto. But, yeah. But, yeah, so, which first was just beaten to death by, not beaten to death, but beaten unconscious by Naruto. Then, then, then just, be, then he just leads place under Genjutsu, and then, or tries to interrogate by Naruto, and then they go, they go to, they go to the lookout, not lookout, but the hideout. When they walk in, Sasuke able to get a dash at Naruto's speed, hoping to cut off Naruto's head. Only with his blade broken and him punched right in the throat by Naruto. Not punched, but kind of just like flicked in the throat really hard. Sasuke fell to the ground coughing. Only to get kicked right in the face by Shikamaru being knocked out. Shikamaru trained insanely hard, like really hard, as hard as possible in this one, just because he felt bad about, about losing Sasuke. Also, you guys may actually kind of glaze over this. How great, you know, Shikamaru fought toe to toe with Sasuke, who's in full Christmark mode, and can use the gates. He was his first gate. There'd be three people who aren't really too notable did that, did that to Sasuke. Sakura pre Sakura pre Shinati training. And Eno, you know, pre time skip. And Shikamaru pre time skip as well. They, they fought Sasuke on even terms. But Sasuke's curse mark gave him a bit of an edge because he because he, he had a bit of a healing factor mix in with that. So yeah. <laughs> so yeah. Now with this we can go on. So yeah, so. So Shikamaru trained as hard as possible, even even with like Kakashi and Jiraiya and Tsunade himself as well, herself as well. I don't know, I don't know if a guy. But yeah, so Shikamaru is roughly around the same level as Sasuke is, and Sasuke is is, an, is he doesn't need need assistance, but he can go and go into like going like imperfect stage mode as well. Shikamaru can match that power. It's how strong he's gotten during this time. But yeah, and now now we go on to Akatsuki's expression where Asuma, Asuma, um. Izumo Kotetsu and actually Shikamaru are on this mission. Still, Shikamaru joined in because he can. Asuma and Asuma, Asuma have been out in a long time. But Asuma would not, would not, would not fight fight Hidon, Shikamaru. Shikamaru already knew how to counter a lot of Hidon's abilities because he researched Hidon. Hidon's beaten into the dirt pretty easily by Shikamaru. No effort. Then, then it's Asuma, Asuma for Kakuzu, and then the fight is more. Is pretty, this is pretty close, but still, Shikamaru joined in and killed, killed, killed Kakuzu himself. He was he was covered in a few in a few bruises from from this from type of heat on. But yeah, yeah. He basically heat on is just buried deep underground, and then he just dies of his own accord, and then Kakuzu is just straight up killed. <laughs> but then we're going to Itachi to Itachi pursuit mission, which honestly wouldn't happen because Itachi and Sasuke are both in the Hindley prison. Also, Itachi's disease, disease was cured by Tsunade, so dope. If you guys are wondering about, wondering, wondering about like he's if he's still inside Kamehameha. No, he's not. He's 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 puked out. Then 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 he 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 he, 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 he did try to try to escape, only to run, to run the hands with my guy in Rock Lee. Then that didn't end well for him whatsoever. He got he, he almost got killed again. Then he's, he's just he's just in his prison cell, Sami Hada being being shot down to a table. Then we have Driver's Pain. Driver's a mastered sage now. Driver smoked every path of pain like it was nothing. 
He killed them all. Then eventually, eventually when he came down to just to like just Yaiko, but he put it in a scroll and then just fought Conan again, beat her, then went on into Nagato and then brought Nagato back to Konoha and put him in prison. He smoked the hidden the hidden, the hidden ring village on his way out too. In his, in, his, in his way, he beat into the dirt. So yeah. <sighs> despite despite Orchard being a sage too, Dry still the strongest Sani of all time. He's still the strongest. Hell, if it's if not he thought about thought about, about, about learning sage moment once he heard that when she heard that Orchard and Dry are both master sages now. I was wondering wondering about how how like how like Orchard did it. He honestly just used Kabuto's DNA and a lot of the blood in the town four to make himself a like perfect sage because that's how Kabuto did it. So yeah. So yeah. Then we have, then we have the pain assault arc, which wouldn't happen because pain's in jail. Five the five card summit. So Sonny is there with Naruto, with Naruto Shikamaru, and Shino as her guards. And well, Mifune isn't under isn't under any genjutsu, and plus most of the most of the Katsuki are dead besides besides um uh, yeah, really, really just Hashi, Kisame, Obito, and Sa and Zetsu, but most of the most of the guys, most of the guys are in jail besides Obito and Zetsu. But when Obito arrived, no, not no, not so Shikamaru be being be running the ones with him, with Shino defending every every single Kage by, by himself. And B is actually with A here because he never fought Sasuke. Also, all the hideouts that Orochimaru had were raided, and then Jugo Jugo tried to try to run the ones with Naruto and got and almost got got murdered in one punch. Yeah, basically, all the Orochimaru hideout subjects are all in prison. <laughs> Again, besides besides Jugo Cardi and Sugetsu, because so is a is, is, is living Konoha as a scientist alongside Cardi and Jugo. Also, also, also Sanji's, Sanji's, Sanji's medical expertise with about his findings. She learned how she learned, she learned how to help Jugo control his curse mark. She did really good with him. So yeah. So yeah. But we have um. We just have, we have, we have, we have Naruto and Obito running, running the ones, which, well, Naruto and Obito, Naruto, Naruto, Naruto and Shikamaru are running the ones with Obito. Zetsu just having an army, army trying to fight the five Kage, only to have Shino take them all out in one fell swoop. Yeah, so the five Kage are amazed at Shino's strength. And shockingly, Shikamaru and Shino combined can run the ones with Killer B, going, going, if Killer B were to go, uh, were to go anything beyond Seven Tails, else he'd win, but if he went anything below Seven Tails, so he may find an equal match in Shikamaru and Shino. She knows a deadly assassin at this point. She knows been trained in every level of the Ambu, the Ambu tactics, even trained, trained by Donzo at some points. But he didn't fall into Donzo's darkness or the or the root. So, yeah. Shikamaru and Shino were, 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 were both trained by Donzo and all Konoto senseis and Tsunade and Naruto. They are a force to be reckoned with. So, yeah. But Naruto and Shikamaru do beat down Obito themselves. Yeah, yeah. Oh, Obito can't. Obito commonly cannot keep up. With, can't keep up. With, keep up with Naruto's speed. Yeah. Oh, Obito had his mask broken and had his, then had his eye snatched out at the same moment. Like at the same moment, his eyes, his mask, his mask was broken. And his one eye is torn right, right, right out of his face. Then with him, with him not, not being, I mean, it would come anymore. Just, just punch right, right in the face again and knocked out. Then Zetsu just covered in bugs and then just, just, just held in place because he can't get out of the bugs. Eventually, just he gets a hole punch right through him, then just then, 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 it's obviously, it's obviously just five, five, five characters submit for like a routine meeting at the same at this point. But uh, yeah, we can move on past this. So you probably just Borzo now. Oh, he goes in prison. Then eventually they become um, the ally on the good side. So yeah. Then um, Zetsu just kept in a scroll the whole time until the scroll was scroll destroyed, and which killed Zetsu at the same time. Naruto and Sasuke, when they were 18, were training, and then they met Hagoromo through just coincidence, and they, they, yeah, they got, they got six-mass power. But Naruto no, 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 needed it, because at the time he was 18, he surpassed Hagoromo. That's how strong he was, which is sheer, sheer ninjutsu and Master, master Nine Tails power. So, by 18, he surpassed Hagoromo. Sasuke surpassed Hagoromo at age 20. So, yeah. Now, now, now we just move on to Boruto. Uh, pause real quick. First fight that we go over is probably just Naruto and Sasuke versus, versus Momoshiki. 
Do I need to under? Do I need to tell you how much how much Naruto and Sasuke would stomp this man individually? Even even if he absorbed Kinshiki, Naruto and Sasuke individually can stomp him into the dirt by themselves. Yeah, this is not this is not a contest. Hell, when you're in Konoha, the whole the whole Konoha twelve the whole Konoha twelve like in the only people cannot put put Moshiki in a pack by themselves. It's literally, it's literally, it's literally just Ino and Tenten. Those ones that cannot pack him by themselves. Lee has the eight gates. Neji has the eight gates as well. They all, they all can use at least some version of the gates individually. Plus, they all have, they all have mastered. They all have mastered and have mastered in ninjutsu. Yeah, Moshiki dies. She she won't touch him. Shikamaru is too crafty to to avoid. Toji's 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 gates gates with butterfly mode would kill him individually. Sakura is a master master hundred healings user. The list goes on. So yeah, so he arrived in Konoha. Oh, actually no, he wouldn't even even get to Konoha. By the time that he, by the time that Sasuke would fight him and Kenshiki in like the whole different dimension, he kills Kenshiki in a second and then kills Moshiki right after that. And keep in mind, Naruto has one arm still. Well, at this point, Naruto is an adult. Looks just like this when he trains. Plus, he has two kids. So yeah, then we have, then we have Naruto. We have Naruto versus Ishiki. And Naruto can pack him individually too, without Baryon mode. Like Ishiki's, Ishiki's shocked if he's deserving of the seventh gate. Like, like when it came down to Jigen versus Naruto and Sasuke using using the Kerma cloaks, that was overkill. They almost killed Jigen with that. Jigen almost died because they, because they went all out when they didn't need to. Plus, they have like they have powerhouses like like like, like Itachi and Kisame still in their prison cells who are willing to join them. Well, actually, no, not Tachi, but Kisame and Obi. No, actually, just Kisame really and is still in the prison cell. <laughs> so it's Obi and Haku, but they they they, they, they are let, let, let out to wander the wander, wander the world for a bit. But they brought back in not long after. Okay, so Jigen was almost packed up, and eventually it's released to Ishiki. Well, Dry and Dry and together together can pack Jigen. So yeah, that's how the first two have gotten. But yeah, so. Yeah, so Naruto and Sasuke, well, not, not Sasuke, just Naruto packs, packs Ishiki by, by, by himself. Uh, yeah, Boro did arrive once Jigen was defeated. But Boro just got packed up by, like, by like Kid Boruto still. But Boruto didn't need Borushiki because there's no Borushiki. But then we meet Kawaki. Well, that fight that, that still happens. Uh, yeah, what else, what else happens? Shinuchiya can happen, but Sakura, Sakura just honestly one taps him with no, with in her base form with no hundred healings. Sakura is way stronger than she's in canon, like way stronger. Yeah, Sakura, Sakura, the moment Shin just tore his head off, like he's like he's nothing. You have Urshiki, if you want to count him, count him going in, and then Urshiki just one tapped by Naruto. Come to Delta. That was not a fight. That was that was just domestic abuse. The moment Delta arrived. She got, she, she got she got torn in half by Naruto in his base form. Not even not even powering up to, to use the gates or anything. Just grabbed her and tore her in half. So yeah, that, that was just the fight. We have, we have, we have New Way, which New Way didn't didn't really do anything. So yeah, but honestly, this is just the end of the list. Not the list, but the end. Well, the list and the what if. If you enjoyed, like and subscribe for, for another what if. Adios.